<laughs> what? <laughs> As you can see, my Starlink is back. For those of you that don't know, I traveled with it sometime in December, installed it elsewhere, which means that I had to change the address from the location that I had set for Starlink when I was buying it. You know, when you're buying Starlink, you tell them that, you know, this is your house address. Then you buy the Starlink to your house address, but you can change your address. Um, I did that sometime in December, and now I probably should have not changed my address because um, the issues I have right now was because I changed my address from where I bought it to a different place. Changing the address was not an issue, right? But um, the thing is, I had traveled to Abia State with it, mounted it in Abia State. It was fast. It was really, really good. I even did a connection test, like a speed test for Abia State. You're going to find it on this channel. So it was okay. It was working fine. But one of the things that came up when I was changing the address from Lagos to Abia State was a notification. I was told that I might not be able to change the address back to my house address if I change the address. And I was like, yeah, yeah, you know, leave me alone, Starlink. I'm going to change my thing. I went ahead and changed it to a location in Abia State, used it throughout December and New Year. And then I came back to Lagos, tried changing the address back to my house and it wasn't working. Why was it not working? Well, Lagos was congested. There are now a lot of people in Lagos, Kano and Abuja who are using Starlink. So Starlink suggested I switch to a mobile plan because that was the only solution, right? What you have on your Starlink plan when you buy it is a standard plan or a fixed plan. But, um, if you're changing your address anyhow or you change your address and you cannot change it back they'll advise you to get a mobile plan i went ahead and i subscribed to the mobile plan but as you can tell the mobile plan is actually slow um i'm going to put that on my screen so you can see it so since i came back to lagos changed my plan to the mobile plan which is even like ten thousand naira more expensive the the standard plan for starlink is 38k 38,000 naira per month as at the time of recording this video but the mobile plan which is the roaming the mobile plan because you're moving around and you're changing address is actually 49,000 naira that's like 10k 11k more and the speed is not even that fast it's not fast at all so that is how i almost destroyed my starlink i reached out to support told them that i would do anything to just get the standard plan back on my house address and they were like yeah the thing is lagos is congested right now so you can't actually get the standard plan again there are a lot of people who are already on the standard plan it is satellite internet so i'm stuck with the mobile plan and yeah my advice for you is if you really really need to change your location for your starlink make sure that you're moving to maybe like a new house or something don't change your address anyhow while it's easy to change your address you should not be doing it um anyhow it's it's not good it's not good because they will ask you to stay on the mobile plan eventually and that's what happened to me so now i am on the mobile plan go ahead and subscribe ask me any questions you have about starlink mtn spectranet cyberspace airtel glow ng come just ask me and i will help you in any way that i can so i'll see you guys around take care bye